the other paper. We're taking a little time with one of our favorite crew players here in Columbus, Robbie Rogers. We're actually up in his apartment. Robbie, tell us a little bit about uh, why you picked this apartment when you're here in the Short North. Um, this is my second year living in the Short North. And uh, I think the main reason why I love it so much is because I can walk everywhere, you know. Skateboard around, there's great restaurants, uh, good little cafes, good shops. So uh, when people visit me, they always have stuff to do. So I really like this area, and uh, I don't know why I haven't lived here longer. All right, um, I'll give you a tour of my, my new apartment. I just moved in about two months ago, so bear with me, it's not, uh, it's not complete. Uh, it used to be all brick actually when I first saw it, and now it's uh, drywall. It makes it look clean, but I kind of liked it more before. So uh, here's everything else: my couch, my lefty cactus. Um, I think I gotta get this painting. In. This is uh, Steve Lenhart's old painting. Uh, we had an old apartment. It's actually California Beach uh, down south, and we wanted to have something from California um, in our apartment. So when he left and went to California, I told him that, you know, I gotta have it. We gotta have a, a little piece of home here. Um, I put this sign, this picture on my front door because, uh, sometimes when you get home after a game or after training and your teammates come over, you don't really want to talk about soccer unless there's a Champions League game on or, or another league game. So I put this on my door so people would read it and have a laugh and, uh, kind of think that, okay, maybe I'm going to come into Robbie's place and not just talk to him about about training or about whatever. Um, check your boots at the door. Um, and I think every soccer player knows what that means. A lot of my teammates and I have become big fans of uh, the Anne Robinette candles. Her offices where she makes candles and sell, sells them is off of Buttles in the short north. Um, I've actually helped her make candles and uh, I used to use her internet. So she's a really cool lady. Um, she's become a good friend with a bunch of us. And, uh, you know, like if you walk around my apartment and it's filled with her candles, I, I would definitely go check it out if you're in the area. So at crew practice today, I was talking a little bit to Robbie, and as you saw, he's going to be barbecuing tonight, and he was talking about this great patio that he has his grill on. Let's go see this patio with the grill, <laughs> shall we? Make sure you show them the view, though. <laughs> and, Andy Iroh put his jersey up, so every time I walk by, I get some inspiration to, to try to play like him. Robbie's patio. <laughs> the best view in Columbus. Best view in Columbus, yes. How many people do you think we can get out here? Probably like 12. If they go all the way down the stairs. <laughs> A two story patio. Okay, we're going to go ahead and walk around the short north and check out some Robbie's favorite spots. Okay. Robbie walks out of his house and comes right to his gym, Oxygen, in the short north. Danny, he's a Danny, uh, we live together. Uh, yeah, I train. No, I train. <laughs> <laughs> the best soccer world, the player in the world. <laughs> this is Oxygen, this is the gym I work out at. Uh, it's actually below me. Um, I like it because it's small, and it's not too many people.
it's for a charity and it's actually to um, uh, raise awareness for kids in Congo that are uh, you know, fallen soldiers. They, they just get a whistle, not a weapon, and people are shooting at them. They're supposed to blow the whistle to warn uh, the army that people are coming. So it's, uh, there's a website, it's like fallingwhistle.com. Just check it out. Again, my favorite shop in the Short North Brigade. Um, a lot of cool clothing. Uh, maybe my clothing line will be in here one day. Uh, um, this area is really cool. You know, a lot of spring, summer stuff. Uh, Larry's rocking this jacket right here. I mean, it's pretty sick. Maybe a little warm to buy it now, but um, really cool stuff. So if you're in the area, check it out. You know, it's uh, different. It's definitely different than a lot of places. Uh, They've got a lot of unique stuff. It's not like a Notions or Macy's. It's a uh, you know, more individual individuality. How did you find this place? Um, skateboarding. My, we, my, my roommates and I we used to go to Cup of Joe all the time. And when they first saw the year was Cruise Day, and we met Larry, we became fans right away. And so uh, just kept a relationship with him. And, Thanks a lot. Cheers.